Right now to our series, Flipping the Script, featuring people on screen, on stage, and behind the scenes, we're shining a spotlight on diversity. Enter Zenobia Shroff, the Indian-American actress, has been dazzling on the screen for more than three decades, but she says one of her most recent projects is something she's never done before. Last year, Shroff took the plunge into the Marvel streaming universe, playing Munibha Khan, the mom to Miss Marvel in the popular Disney Plus show. While her career is flourishing now, she says it wasn't always that way. Who do you want to be in this world? Do you want to be good? How does it feel to be part of the Marvel Universe? It's pretty cool. Where did you hear that name? Suddenly, after 30-something years, you're told, let's strap you in a harness and have you fly kind of thing. It's very different. Did you ever think you would be in a superhero show? I always had some fantasy of doing a real kick-ass, badass kind of gal. Cool, is this nannies? That is just a jump. I don't know how, when, where she would manifest, but not not this stuff at all. You feel like you're kind of living out that dream now? Absolutely, absolutely. What does it mean to have a show about a Pakistani-American family on TV, on streaming right now? It means everything. I started this journey 30-something years ago in America where I was told to change my name and um, get dialect classes to speak like an American. i multiple agents. No one would hire me. No one knew what to do with me. It's the line that Nakia says in our show in episode two, I'm too white to be ethnic and I'm too ethnic to be white. So the weight of this is not lost on me at all. It's, it sort of makes me quite emotional. I'm uh, guessing you hear reaction from viewers who are as emotional as you are when they watch the show. What do you hear? Absolutely. It was overwhelming how many brown women and their daughters wrote to say thank you. And, and I think it was really a watershed moment in, in, in American TV in that sense. The authenticity of the story is key, isn't it? Absolutely. Sana Amanat, who is our creator, is a Muslim American woman from uh, New Jersey. Myself and Mohan, who plays my husband, we uh, we were born and raised in Mumbai. We'd walk into the set and we'd say, this is Indian, this is Indian, this is not Pakistani. I think we were all collectively committed to seeing that it was authentically Muslim and Pakistani. A lot of the viewers watching right now may uh, recognize you from the Oscar-nominated movie, The Big Sick. This is Zubeda. How big of a deal was that role for you? That, big, that role was very big for me. That really put me on the sort of uh, Hollywood map, if you will. That was also, I think, a very seminal moment in independent cinema because it showed you this cross-cultural love affair and um, it, it got so much love. You have a master's in psychology. Does that uh, come in handy when it comes to acting? Every day. <laughs> in the end, acting is nothing but the, you know, exploration of the human condition. For that, you have to get into the psychology, if you will, of the character and so... I, I definitely use it every day, yeah. For the young brown girls out there who are looking at you and saying, I, I want to get in this industry, what's your advice? My advice is this is your moment. The world has changed. Uh, TV is changing. So if you want to do it, do it. Know your lines, get on set, be polite, be nice to your crew, do the work. The work will see you through. Our thanks to Zenobia Shroff for taking time to talk with us. You can check out Miss Marvel on demand right now on Disney+. Plus. I, I love that she has a master's in psychology. I and love is, that is question and actor. uses it every day, and she's yeah. so right. You do have to get your... I mean, it feels like all actors should know a little bit about psychology. Exactly. <laughs> Got to get exactly. into the mind and of the character. And now she's in the Marvel Maybe, you know, in the next season, she'll, you know, do some more fighting or a little yeah. action stuff. Who knows? To go <laughs> knows? from being told to change your name, yep. to change the way you talk. Yeah to this being her authentically on the screen, good for her. And it's important for young people to hear that that, you know, there's still obstacles certainly, but how much things have changed. And you don't have to compromise. Exactly, you are. exactly, it's a great lesson. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.